Christ Jesus. It's indeed an honor to be part of this service today. Our missionary, uh, we still as it good to be in the house. All of my, I don't want to, I don't like to call names because I forget names, you know. So I'm going to say all of my sisters and brothers in Christ Jesus. I'm trying to act real good right about now. Hallelujah. I said I'm trying to go shy. I'm trying to act good. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Hallelujah. I'm here to do the welcome. Oh my God, I'm here to do the welcome. I, 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 I feel the Holy Ghost.
And I know the Holy Spirit has made everyone feel welcome on tonight. And um, we are going to go up just a little bit higher and then a little bit higher after that and then a little bit higher after that. Amen. So our bishop, I call him our bishop. <laughs> I call him bishop. <laughs> but um, superintendent, um, be at this time and um, he is uh, going to raise the uh, offering so how many of you know that giving is a part of worship amen giving is a part of worship and tonight we are coming to show honor to our very own district missionary who labors so hard in prayer and we appreciate that I don't know about y'all, but sometimes when I come in here and after she has prayed, um, you can just feel the anointing. It is so tangible. Um, I've come in with burdens many times, and she did the praying, and yes, Lord, and before you know it, you're lost. <laughs> and you are yes, Lord, and the Lord just comes in and does what he wants. So we always like to honor the, the angel of this house, the man of God for our appointed house. So Judo Worship Center, we know we stand to our feet to receive our man of God as he comes at this time. Amen. Come on, just lift your hands and just worship God in this place. Come on, all over this building while you're standing, just lift those hands and worship him. He's, he's worthy of the worship. Come on, he's worthy. Come on, let him know how much you love him. Come on. Let him know how much you love him tonight. Come on, lift your voice. Lift your voice. Lift your voice. Hallelujah. Praise him. Praise him. Come on. Praise him. Come on, everybody. Praise him. Jesus. Bless the Savior. He's worthy. worthy. Come on, everybody. Praise him. Pray. Oh, yes, praise him. Oh, yes, praise him. Pray. Pray. Jesus. Bless the Savior. He's worthy to be. Oh, praise him. Lift 
Won't you just look at somebody and tell them, I'm so glad to be back in the house of the Lord uh, one more night. Uh, it is a blessing indeed, amen, to be here in our second night of the Hope District Holy Convocation. Come on, saints, you ought to give God a hand raise for that. The Lord blessed us on last night, amen, a great start, great foundation, what the Lord has done for us. And we thank God, amen, tonight, amen, is established to be our women's night, amen, and Missionary Whitfield has done an awesome job. Uh, come on, Judah Worship Center, clap your hands for Missionary. Come on, we can do better than that. Come on, Judah. Yes. Done an awesome job tonight, and I thank God for, and always thank God for our sainted mother, amen, Mother Jackson. Say amen for Mother Jackson, yes. Amen. Good to see, amen, some of our visitors and friends tonight. Amen. Uh, Missionary Crosby. Come on, give her a hand praise. Yes. From First Church, God bless you. Amen. Good to see Missionary, amen, Fisher. Amen. From our Family and Friends Church in Cameron, Texas. Give her a hand praise, saints. Yes. All the way from Tyler, Texas. They have just, my God, blown my mind. Pastor and First Lady Ward tonight. Give them a hand, praise. Hallelujah. These are my friends. Amen. Amen. They have come and got this missionary with them. Amen. Tonight. Amen. Stuart. Amen. For coming. Amen. We probably be some cousins. Amen. My mother uh, made a name is Stuart. Amen. You never know. Amen. And we got some kin folks back in Jacksonville, Texas, and New Summerfield. We cousins. I mean, a long time ago, if if the same ethnic race of if you was uh, of African descent and your last name was Jones and other ones Jones, y'all was cousins. Y'all ain't saying that, amen. So we probably somewhere down the bloodline. Say amen, somebody. Amen. We're so thankful for all, amen. Mother Harris been here. God bless you. Give her and pray tonight. Thank you for coming. And our invited guests, amen, have made their arrival. Come on now. Superintendent Andrews and his lovely wife, Prophetess Andrews. Come on, stand and give them a hand praise. Amen. Have made their arrival tonight on a Thursday night. God bless you. Amen for coming. We have enjoyed our program thus far. Amen. I thank God for all those who have been on the program. Amen. It's fine missionary, Sister Brown, for uh, leading this program. Amen for us tonight. Say amen for her. Amen. And Sister Missionary Bowers, amen. And uh, Sister Williams, amen. And all of you who have participated on the program. Now, some say, well, Pastor, I shown need me a program. Listen, this program, amen, uh, our program committee has done an awesome job, and we're trying our best to establish and do just what our jurisdiction do. And not only what our jurisdiction do, but what the national church do. Amen. So you need a program so you can help wave it on Sunday. Amen. You need an official program. Y'all say amen, somebody. 
And you need an official program, amen. Just go out in the foyer, amen. Go to the welcome desk and get you one for a small offering of $5. Now, just in case, you know, your card uh, cannot reach the $5 limit, just in case you don't have $5 in your pocket, amen. We made it affordable for everybody. If you have a phone, you can just uh, uh, scan the a QR code here on the screen and it'll pop up on your phone. Uh, just take your phone and take a little picture of it. And uh, now if your phone is flipped, you just <clears throat> just hang on. Amen. Just just tell somebody to, uh, to whisper you the program. Amen. But <laughs> people do still carry flip phones. Amen. Amen. Uh, so if you got a flip phone, just, just don't even try to take a picture of this. Amen. Just don't even worry about it. Amen. But if you want to see the program, amen, just take your phone and, and pull up that QR code and, and you can uh, follow through with the program. But we have a nice printed program all this week. Amen. You cannot miss out what God is about to do. Um, before we take our offering, I want Sister Tamika to elaborate right quick. Sister Tamika on the uh, Saturday morning uh, what we have set up. Amen. Say amen, Sister Tamika. Amen. Amen. If you will allow me from the floor. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. I didn't want to be out there. <laughs> Some of you honor the uh, procedures of the house. Amen. Um, this Saturday, we are inviting everyone to come out. We are having a leadership training. And this leadership training is called Keepers of the Oil. Amen. And we are going to have Superintendent Brandon Hubbard with us. For those of you who may not know him, he um, is the superintendent of the Chilton ISD School District. And um, he was named superintendent of the year, I think two years ago, if I'm not mistaken. And he is an amazing, amazing, amazing man of God. He literally travels to different churches um, doing this leadership training. So we want everyone in the house to come. It is going to be this Saturday at the Hilton Garden Inn. The doors open at 8.30 a.m. Training is going to begin at 9 a.m. We know that, I don't know about y'all, but I like breakfast. So we are having a buffet breakfast. Amen. So come on out. <laughs> We're going to have a good meal, good fellowship, and then good teaching. Amen. And Sister Marnita Davis, Sister, wave your hands for us. You get all of that. Good teaching, good meal, good fellowship, good learning and training for only $20. The low, 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 low price of just $20. We do have limited seating, so we ask that you don't wait to get your ticket. Go ahead and see Sister Marnita tonight. Um, and that training is open to those who would like to come. But I would say don't miss it, because when we come out of that, we're all going to understand how to be keepers of the oil. Amen. Amen. Uh, where's Sister Davis at? Sister Davis. So, Davis, I'm going to take care of uh, me, my 20, my wife, 20, my mother, the church, and missionary. That's four, that's four of us. That's right. Amen. And I got one more 20 left out of this. Amen. And we're going to save that 20. Amen. For Mother Hughes. Amen. Come on, say Amen. So that take care. Give me five tickets for that. And now we have limited space for that now. That's Dr. Amen. Brandon Hubbard. That's Dr. Yes, Brandon Hubbard will be in uh, for that leadership uh, breakfast. Amen. So make sure you get with Sister Davis and uh, $20, that ain't nothing. The way gas prices is now. Amen. $20 is not that. Amen. Just go ahead and give that or we can move forward. All right. I'm asking. Uh, come on, um, sister, uh, some of the missionaries of this church. Uh, come on, sister. Nikki, help me out, sister Nikki. But the rest, y'all give me that table. Help me out, sister Nikki. Uh, sister Nikki, and come on, sister Jasmine, come to this table here. Y'all will help me get the offering. 
Clap your hands for them, amen, as they, as they come in. Yes. We're going to be a blessing to Mother Jackson right quick. Brother Durant, you can stay there with me, amen. Come on up here, Sister Nikki. Amen. We're going to be a blessing to Sister Vivian Whitfield, missionary tonight. Amen. Sometimes, amen, a lot of folks don't like to bless other people. But there's nothing wrong with blessing somebody. Amen, three of y'all. There's nothing wrong with blessing somebody. Amen. And Sister Whitfield, amen, is an important piece not only to our district, but to our local church. I got three witnesses on that. Amen. Not only to our district, but to our local church every Tuesday and Thursday. She's here praying. I'm going to tell you this, Sister Whitfield. Uh, I don't think I ever told you this before. But Bishop Agarhart told me, son. He said, hey, man, uh, uh, whenever you're gone, uh, just give the church over to Sister Whitfield. <laughs> he said, I'm telling you, I used to run the church in Rosebud, and I put her mama in charge, and everything went fine. He said, if you put her in charge, it'll go well, I guarantee you. <laughs> he said, Sister Whitfield just had it in her bloodline to make sure everything go well. Listen, we want to be a blessing tonight. Amen. But before we start, I'm going to ask Minister Durrell to bless the offering. Come on, bless the offering. Father God, in the name of Jesus, God, we thank you, God, on tonight. God, just bless this offering, to God, that we're about to receive and lift it up for your kingdom. In Jesus' name, amen. On tonight's offering, I'm asking you now, I'm going to do something much larger than what I asked you. And I have some friends tonight, and I, God, I got some friends, and just, I can point my finger at one of my friends. They're going to help me out. Amen. But I got some friends tonight that will help me out. I'm asking you, if you can tonight, this is not much. Amen. If every person in here, every grown-up can give a love offering of $20. If every grown-up can give a love offering of $20, would be just a blessing for us tonight. Because we're going to do over and above. Our church is going to do over and above. I just believe that meetings don't have to be burdened down with money. Say amen, somebody. We're going to be over and above. I, me and my wife, we're going to give $300 a night. Amen. To be a blessing to missionary. But I'm asking you only to give $20. Will those persons just by a sign and say, Pastor, I'm with you tonight. Will you stand with that gift? Come on. Thank you, Brother Raven. Those who have cars, you can go right to the back. Thank you, Sister Carter. I'm going to start this for $300. Amen. Thank you, Sister Director. She's standing. Thank you, Sister Harris. Thank you, April. Look at the people. The cash app is on the board. Amen. Thank you, my sister. Thank you, uh, Brother Harrison. Thank you. Thank you. Amen. Thank you, Crofton. She's given 40. Amen. To be a blessing. Amen. Thank you, Pastor Ward. He's given 20. Amen. Thank you. Thank you, Pastor. All, thank you, Superintendent. He's given 20. Amen. Others, amen, are cash shopping. All over the building. Will you come bring your offer tonight? Come on. Bring your offer. Let's be a blessing. Amen. Blessed be the name, blessed name of 
There you go. He is worthy. And I know. So we lift up on. Thank you. Thank you for your giving tonight. Amen. Clap your hands for what you have done on tonight. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do better than that. Clap your hands. Yes. Amen. And this time we're going to give back to the over to the hands. Sister Mickey. Hallelujah. We thank God for your liberal giving on tonight. Amen. Amen. So at this time, we're going to ask our district missionary to come forward. I think she has some special mar remarks and presentations. It's for right there. So you guys put your hands together, and let's honor her as she comes. And I think she has the missionaries who are going to be assisting her on tonight. So if y'all will go ahead and come forward quickly, we'd appreciate it. Give honor to God tonight to my pastor and superintendent, praise God, and my first lady. Amen. Praise God. Amen. A good leader, praise God. One that gives the word without adding and without taking away. Amen. Praise God. Amen. I thank God for letting him letting me have this time. Praise God. Amen. At this time. Um, first, lady. first lady. Amen. We have first lady and our invited guest, Amen, Evangelist Andrew. Just a little something to say, we love you. Man. Sister Crossley, praise God. Mother Jackson. Mother Huge. Angelus Joyce. First Lady Ward. Amen. Amen. We have some extra here, so we don't give the missionary. Uh, missionary. Yeah. We give our visitors one. Amen. Uh, Mother, yeah, Mother Harrison. Thank you all for coming out tonight. Praise God. Amen. At this time, give it back to Missionary Brown. Amen. Thank God. That was so beautiful. How many of you know the scripture says that we give double honor to those who it is worthy of? Amen. So we thank God. Um, I said, I went to the back. I looked at that bag. I said, who get Michael Kors tonight? <laughs> <laughs> but I tell you, the, the ladies of this church love our first lady so much. Um, set such a wonderful example for all of us. So first lady, you deserve every ounce of Michael Kors. <laughs> amen, amen. So at this time, we're going to be queuing up the music back there. And I want you guys to put your hands together for the Judah Worship Center Ministry Praise Team and Dance. These ladies come with it every time, and I tell you, you're going to enjoy them. Amen.
open space is safe. Heaven is waiting for the mention of the name. Hallelujah. Beautiful. Speak the name of Jesus. Amen and amen. Well, at this time, I guess if I, um, let me see how to best do this. Let me just start right here. She is a woman of God. She is a wife. She is a mother. 
She is one of the hardest working women in ministry that I know. She is an encourager. She is a strong prayer warrior. She is a prophetess. And she is the sweet fragrance of this house. So true to worship center, I want you to put your hands together. Stand to your feet. And I'm going to pull a little bit of bishop tonight. And I'm going to say, let's welcome our very own elect lady, Vicki L. Beecham. Amen and amen. Just put your hands together one more time on tonight. If that was for me, I would really love it. But I know our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, deserves just a little bit more praise than that. For he is the one that gives you the activities of your limbs. He gave you a peace of mind on today. He even gave you a mind to just come to church. Not only that, he just simply woke you up this morning. So I know by the clapping of your hands and by the lifting of your voice, I to be much louder than that. Hallelujah. That's the name of the Lord. I thank God for being here on tonight. I give honor to whom all honor is due. I'm up here to introduce um, my good friend on tonight. My my boyfriend. I tell my grandkids, I say, that's my, I have a boyfriend. And they tell me, no, you don't. You don't have no boyfriend. You have a husband. <laughs> Excuse me if I cough a little bit or sound a little weird. Excuse my um, voice. I've been a little under the weather this week. But nevertheless, I yet give God all the praise and all the glory. Um, but I do give honor to the pastor, visiting pastor, to the evangelist on tonight, and to all the mothers and all the ones in the house of the Lord. Um, I almost a little lost for words on tonight for him. <laughs> He's an amazing, amazing, amazing an amazing man. He's he's very amazing. He amazed me every time. Every time I, I see him, he amazed me. I was like, really, Denise? Sometimes that's all I can say. Really, Denise? <laughs> I love him to death. Um, he's a great, great preacher, great, great prayer warrior, great husband, great pastor. Not only that, he's my he's my good friend. He's my he's my best friend. He's my only friend. He's the only friend I got. I tell him at home, I say, it's sad we don't have no friends but each other. We got to do something better than this. <laughs> but if you don't mind, I would love for you to stand for my one and only love. For the pastor of this house, Superintendent Demetrius Beecham. Come on, you can, you can do better than that. He's not the president, but he's my president. you. I was sitting down. I wanted to hear some more. <laughs> amen. Say amen for First Lady Beecham. Come on, say amen for her. Thank you for that amen um, presentation. Listen, we're ready for the word of the Lord. Come on, how I many? We're ready for the word of the Lord. Amen. Praise Dance Team, you've done such an awesome job awesome job amen on tonight always do such an awesome job but i don't know about you i know that god has a word for this house amen on tonight how many just need a word from the lord i got three witnesses on this side how many need a word from the lord amen on this thursday night i just thought it was so befitting amen tonight amen that we include amen her husband have come down and preached for us twice Amen. He's such an awesome speaker himself. Yes. <laughs> I don't. I don't know if the, the choir come tonight. They didn't come. Was able to come, but um, and I'm not a mother solo persons who do sing a solo. Uh, they are not here tonight, but I, I just want to. If you don't mind, if you don't mind. Just before uh, Lady Andrews come forth tonight, if the husband would sing just something, 
you know, I just just something tonight before his wife preached. Give me the other mic. Um, give me the other mic here. Come on, the one that's clean. Now, Pastor and Sister Andrews, now we are cousins for real. We're cousins for real. And after Pastor Andrews have sung just something, I want you to stand again to receive the speaker of the house on the night. Receive her because God has a word just for you. Come on, God has a word just for you. Make sure that every person, make sure that you share the message. Let people know, amen, that they are in for a treat on tonight. Clap your hands, amen, for Superintendent Andrews. If you love the Lord, clap those hands and praise the Lord, everybody. Come on, praise the Lord, everybody. Just look at somebody next to you and tell them the Lord's been good to me. I just want to know having the praises in the house tonight. The Lord's been good to you. Certainly to the angel of this house, can we honor this great man of God? Oh, come on, you can do better than that. Come on, let's stand and give him a rouse and applause. He's the superintendent. I just love him. I thank God for him. God for Superintendent Beecham, Ken Fox, and to his lovely wife. Come on, let's bless the woman of God. Real soon, he, he, Jesus Christ is coming real soon. I'm just so glad to be here tonight with my wife, and I want to thank God for some of the elders that came with us tonight and a few of our members, but we need to hear word tonight. Since last we've seen each other, we've all been through some things. But tell your neighbor, Jesus Christ is coming back. Oh, come on, what the saints said, tell somebody Jesus is coming back. You better not cry. You better not pounce. You better not cry. I'm telling you why. This is how the saints get excited. Jesus Christ is coming Ooh, real soon. He, he's, he's making a list. He's checking it twice. He's going to find out. Yeah, I done. Who's been naughty and nice? Oh, Jesus Christ is coming. Real soon. He knows when you are sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows when you've been bad or good. So be good for goodness sake. You better not cry. You better not pout. You better not shout. Whoa! I'm telling you why. Tell your neighbor, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Jesus Christ is coming real soon. And this is the district convocation. Tell your neighbor, real soon. Come on, saints, real soon. Real, real soon. Oh, Jesus Christ. May his baby, seed of Abraham, is coming 
Now lift your hands while you're standing. The word of God is coming. And tell him, yes. I wish I had some saints in here. Come on. Yes. All over the room. Yes. Oh, no. Yes. Come on. Yes. 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 Yes, Lord. Come on, come on, come on. Yes, Lord. Come on with my real worshipers. Yes, Lord. Yeah, yeah. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. Father God, in the name of Jesus. We thank you tonight for your goodness and for your mercy. We're honored to stand behind this sacred desk. God, I ask, oh God, that you would come into this place. Use me for your glory. But God, most of all, have your way in the name of Jesus. God, we've come tonight to receive a word. God, we come from all walks of life. We all have different issues and circumstances, but God, tonight, we've convened in this place, God, asking you, oh God, to release your glory. Uh, send your anointing, God. Uh, let your Shekinah glory fill this atmosphere. Satan, God, rebuke you. Uh, in the name of Jesus, we decree tonight uh, that God will get the glory. Uh, we decree deliverance. Uh, we speak healing. We speak breakthrough. And by faith, we call it done. Now, God, walk up and down the aisles. Move how you want to move. Do what you want to do. God, get the glory tonight. Touch our superintendent. Touch our district missionary. Bless our first lady. And for everyone assembled tonight, God, get the glory. Huh? Send healing. Send your power. Huh? Send your glory. Huh? And God, for this, huh? we'll tell you thank you. Huh? Can anybody tell the Lord thank you? Huh? Before it's already done, huh? open up your mouth. Huh? Give God praise. Huh? Do it on credit. Huh? Tell him thank you. Huh? Thank you on credit. Huh? What do you believe in God to do? Huh? Lift up your hand. Open up your mouth uh, and say, thank you, Jesus. Huh? Come on, tell him thank you. 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 Clap your hand and tell him thank you. Come on, tell him thank you. Open up your mouth and tell God thank you. Oh, do I have anybody in the house tonight that know that God's been real good to you? Look at somebody and say, neighbor, God's been real, 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 real good, real good in my soul, real good in my spirit. Look at somebody and say, real good, real good. Oh, I feel the Holy Ghost. I said, I feel the Holy Ghost. Listen, I don't know about you, but I've been through something on just this week. And it's a prime indication that I knew God was going to move tonight in a supernatural way because Whenever the devil start acting up, you got to know that God is up to something. So I want you to find you a neighbor. Come on, look at your neighbor. Look at him right now and say, neighbor, the last season that I just came out of, I lost a lot of things. But tell him, say, thank God I didn't lose my praise. I didn't lose my glory. I didn't lose my thank you, Jesus. I didn't lose my hallelujah. Anybody still got to pray? See, I still got to praise. Devil tried to take me out. 
but I still got a praise. Devil tried to stop my praise, but I still got a praise. Tried to strike my body, but I still got a praise. Tried to mess with my family, but I still got a praise. Lean over and tell somebody, say name. Ay, 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 ay. the glory I said I feel the glory if you feel the glory raise your hand come on listen we gonna do this thing together because I know that I'm not the only one that's been going through and sometimes you got to let the devil know that regardless of what you throw my way, I'm still going to give him a praise right in the midst of it. Anybody got a point to prove to the devil? Anybody want to help me make the devil out of a liar? But when I count to three, I want you to pick your feet up, open up your mouth, and give God praise. Are you ready? Are you ready? One, two, three, rise him. Oh, pick your feet up, come on. Everybody praise him. Something! <laughs> 